I'm just gonna get some police stations along at least up to Kursk and I don't know, Hobble? Maybe even further than that. And now we got a well, I said Bryansk. Did I? Oh yeah, I did. Well, you know what? And we're gonna keep on going with this. I'm just gonna try to get some police uh, centers built, but that's gonna reduce the revolt risk a little bit around them. Not necessarily gonna be enough, mind you, but it should help. But yeah, we may need to get some uh, troops to the background. Question is like how much? I suppose we are going to need garrisons in anyway, so let's go ahead and start getting some of those. Uh, is this? Yeah, I believe this is the garrison division that we've been using. It does use a fair bit of manpower overall. You know what? We'll pull a total of fifty. That is a lot of manpower. So we're going to be less than thousand now, but it's going to be. Covering most of this. Oh, well, a lot of the bigger cities. True, it is just partisans. But you know what? I'm gonna cancel these. It's gonna at least give us the manpower back and we can get some. Like, I'll probably do in like a cavalry, um, mobile police, and. Let's see, I do have the cavalry here, but I'm not going to be using that template. Recon cav, maybe we'll leave in the headquarters just in case. And then the military police in there as well. There's a lot less manpower, it's still going to be a lot of divisions. I mean, to be fair, how much is the headquarters overall in manpower? It's um, 0 0.1, so it's not that much. I mean, okay, it would be fine manpower saved that way, but it's not really that big of a problem in the cost sector in there at least. I think it's the cavalry that is the biggest one, isn't it? Uh, that is four manpower indeed. So that's like 200 manpower. Yeah, so the cavalry is the biggest one there. Okay, so that's going to give us a, a little bit of extra. Now we can keep some of the supply lines at least clear. Alright, close air support. Where do we need... Oh, right, yeah, you've been doing strikes on where exactly? Or rather, I'm wondering if that is still part of the front line or not. I could do strikes there, or actually, where are you being attacked from? Mostly from there, okay. Hold on. Um, oh, right, yeah, it was in. Oh, we got plenty of planes in Astrakhan. Okay. We don't have a lot of supplies necessarily in Astrakhan, but we've got plenty of planes at least. Send in some interceptors. Set up at least like an interceptor around this region if need be. I don't think there's going to be a lot of uh, plane activity in here, to be fair, but we'll see. Okay, we have been... Oh, dear. Now, this is not great. We need to get some troops in there as quickly as possible. I mean, what I could do, maybe... Oh, we're winning the combat there. Okay. Can we win the combat in here? Or at least uh, kind of delay them. Oh, the Loom is now under attack. Well, we've got some troops in there that are in pretty good shape. But this might at least stop them from moving in, if nothing else. Oh, we did bring in the planes that we need to give orders now. And there's a bit of a... Hmm, what is the game thinking? Oh, nationalist. Oh, we got a lot of uh, industry and some ray extraction and that sort of stuff built as well. Okay, well, this is... Oh, you're waiting for fuel. Okay. Oh, wait, no, we got the cavalry down here. Just in case go there as well. Um, I wonder, actually... You'll be doing logistical bombing over there, that's probably done for already. I should probably do now, is start doing logistical bombing over here for a little bit. We've got three divisions here, we can just cut these off, ice that. It's not out of supplies yet. 
But it's not going to be getting any more. As long as we can have a say on that. Uh, let's send in an infantry division down there. That needs a bit of reinforcement. So at the same time, these two could probably start attacking here. It's just an infantry division and a headquarters. I don't think that's going to be lasting very long. Even though it's just infantry that is doing the attack. But actually, yeah, the infantry is going to be much better in that. Okay, so a little under attack over here for the time being. Is that? Yeah, that's not going to be an issue. This one, I think we're going to get through. Doesn't seem like it's too bad of a situation in here. Do we have more troops in here? We do have two over here. And then we've got a few more over here, but they are just recuperating for the time being. Okay, the enemies over here are losing a lot of strength, at least. Oh, there we go. We had another combat against the submarines. We sank three of them. A pocket battleship has taken some hits. But not too bad. Apparently we need a lot more reinforcements again. Right, let's actually go ahead and pull some of these cavalry divisions to the top of the list. We can get some sort of um, anti piratism duty unit. And we do have a little bit down here that could be moved forward. Although I suppose what I could do with... Well, no, not necessarily with those, but... Yeah, we can start moving forward. We are about to reach the river. I mean, we have actually reached the river already. And we are about to get through this one. So how is... Ooh, actually, that reminds me. We need to import Tungsten. Let's do that so we get a bit of extra heart attack. Um, Spain. We'll buy some from you. And then, yeah, so the manpower is not great right now. Of course, we did just spend like 230 manpower for <laughs> the cavalry. So that's part of the reason. Um... Okay, the police center. Right, so did the... No, that one didn't start yet. So maybe it didn't keep the settings. Hmm. From the events. Oh, event. Well, we'll see. If we can't get the nukes, then we can't get the nukes. Right, I wanted to check their unity again. It has gone down again. Just a little bit. But if we can even keep that speed on reducing it, then eventually they will fall. Is that? Oh dear. I think we're going to have to pull back from there. There's just too many divisions attacking. Enforcements fluctuate a fair bit. Oh right, actually. Another thing that I should probably do is uh, push the police centers forward. Like, it's going to take a lot of bit of time to get them. But we do need them. How's that one going? Not nearly all that great. That was not going to be pushing forward anymore, I reckon, but at least we've got on a little bit of stuff in here. Still haven't managed to push through here. Oh dear. And that one is. No, that one's already put off the combat. This one needs to pull off. And yeah, the supply situation over here is just abysmal. I mean, to be fair, it's just the, a lot of the costs have started piling up and all that. Okay, there we go. We want to combat there. We're getting some more troops down this way. I suppose you don't necessarily need to stay there, do you? Well, you know what? You'll stay there for now. Get some more of your organization back. I wonder if we could... Well, we'll wait for the 3rd Division in there. Oh, right. We've broken some troops there. Let's go ahead and switch the target. A little bit. Oh, Columna. We lost the combat there. At least we didn't shatter. It was just because we didn't have supplies, so we couldn't really push forward. Sank another one of... Oh, wow. These torpedo boats have had some great time, I guess. And we did send in the planes down here, didn't we? How about you start doing some convoy raiding? These are not really that great against submarines. I mean, they can do some damage, of course. Oh, Central Baron C. So there's a l quite a few of them still. But yeah, destroyers is just amazing. At this stage. I mean, they're pretty late uh, era destroyers anyway. Okay, we've got the carrier aircraft prototype 8, so that would be year 1943. Let's just gonna pull that back to the top and keep working on it. 
If we got through here... Oh, right, we got some reinforcements in there now. Excellent. And that stopped their attack. Which means that we should probably stop our attack over here. We're not going to get through that. Besides, we've been bombed rather hard. Where's this combat? Oh, right, actually. One thing that I should do, or make sure, is this one... Your interceptor, are you resting right now? I'm just going to make sure that you are doing air intercept in here. That, that sort of reason. Could not destroy this be special, I might say. Um, yeah, there is a little bit, and I have done some of that. The naval tech over here, the escort specialization, sub attack plus 60. We have got on that. I mean, it's level 6 now, so but it's like plus 10 per level. Escort efficiency, position, it goes down a little bit, but that's not too bad. And yeah, then there's the frigates that we have some. We don't have any on that particular fleet, but we have got on a decent bit on that. Sort of uh, research as well. Okay, looks like the supply situation, at least on this sector, is slowly recovering. Oh, and we found some su submarines down there. Excellent. We've got a bit of bombardments here. Near Sarasov. Okay, that mechanized division needs to pull back. It's not going to hold. Uh, is that... I suppose we can pull that a little bit forward. We've still got one paratrooper in Stalingrad. Which would probably be for the best, to be fair. Um... I wonder, where are you attacking? I know that it should be somewhere in here, I just don't remember. You know what, I'm just going to switch your target in there. Looks like our reinforcements around here are arriving, excellent. And one there. Two over here. Send all three over there. These two can attack there. We've got some of some troops down here that could keep on pushing. If we can get to Sarasov, that'd be nice because that is another victory point area. That's two points there, and then it, if we can get to Kubishev, that's fifteen points. So that's already pretty far. And oh yeah, the unity has started going down even faster. It might actually be partially because of our. Um, convoy rating. There we go, we're getting some progress done here. Wait, is the combat still going on? I guess it is. We start it again. Oh, right, and we did break that one's attacks at least. Oh, those two divisions. Have seized it. Oh, that's okay. Well, we can't go there. We'll just keep on pushing forward. This one should probably stay back. Uh, how's the combat over here? A lot of the enemy headquarters have shattered. That's for sure. We've got the three divisions in here. I think it's time to push forward. It's not out of supplies. Oh, Tungsten Shortage level one. Excellent. Okay, we've got some victories down here at least. Uh, we are going to be able to push here and there. Let's just get you down that way. You're all. Excellent. I think we could maybe start pulling some of these troops out of here. I mean, technically speaking, yeah, we could push forward. Problem is that there's not really that much. I mean, I suppose there might be some resources in it. Well, there's Chromite over there. Helium over there. Maybe helium we already have. Chromite we already have. So it's not necessarily that much. Although, is that. There's a little bit of rare materials there. Even more in here. Okay. What about this one? That's also five base there. Okay, I mean, there's some resources for sure. There's ten over there. Oh. And eight base over here. Okay. But that one we're already taking. And the Russian IC efficiency. Yeah, true. They would require us to push somewhat deep across the river there. I mean, I suppose we could get to this river and hold that as the line because I don't want to push too far in because we already know what's going to happen. It's going to be out of supplies, then we have a massive attrition, and oh dear, we're already under attack here, aren't we? 
or about to be anyway. Yeah. It's nine divisions attacking plus one more in the reserves. Let's send in some infantry divisions down there. Uh, we do have some troops over here that might be able to help soon. Oh, where was this? Oh, a division from here was... Oh, was it attacking alone? Oh, well, I don't think it was attacking alone, but it may be the only one that survived this far. Okay, well, that's a bit of a problem. There's just so much enemy troops in here that I don't think we're going to do much. I'm just going to spread out some of these troops and... I'm going to stop this attack as well. We're not going to get through there. We're, like, I think they got about 300, 400,000 men over here in this sector. It's a bit too much. Uh, true, I mean, there's not that much Russian troops in here. You're not wrong. Oh yeah, it's technically four provinces away, but yeah, it's just... Maybe I'll just get in here and get up to there, so it wouldn't be too big of a problem. i get up to this river, that would be the southern end of the front line. Across the river there. I mean, yeah, getting the chromite would be nice, but I'm not entirely sure if that is the only chromite that they have at this stage. I know that they still got some stuff down here in the far or further east. Uh, there's zinc over there. I know they got copper somewhere because I've seen it. It's aluminum, copper, chromite. So they do have a second chromite. But it's not going to be that good. I mean, perm is going to also be kind of on the side of. I mean, yeah, here goes the Euro, so that's... Tredlovsk is another place that we will try to take, but that is really far away still. And we haven't even started building up the highways kind of past Stalingrad either. So, hmm. That's going to be risky. Okay, we are losing some combat now. I'm not entirely sure where those are happening, because I keep clicking them off before stuff happens. Okay, so you are being bombed. I'm just going to pull you back a little bit. These are going to have to hold there. These are out of supplies. Oh boy. Right, so we did get the planes in here. I just didn't give orders to. Let's start bringing air supplies over here. Like it's just behind the enemy lines, or front line rather, and that might be enough to start Getting some of the supplies to get through at least. Oh, we managed to capture some supplies from somewhere. Oh, huh. okay. Oh, we lost that one. How's this one doing? Oh dear, yeah, that is not great. We've got some infantry moving in there. I'll show we want to come back there. Excellent. Uh, these are not in shape to get into. A step annoyer. Even though there's no one in there right now, if we get in there, then there's going to be a counterattack and these will shatter. So I'd rather ju just keep them in here, digging in for the time being. But this one, I suppose, could actually go in there. And this one. Okay, so we can take that. It's just not with the troops that were on the front line, necessarily. Okay, so we win some, we lose some. 170 manpower now for the reinforcements. So, yeah, not great. I'm going to pull that one back. It's out of supplies and it's a lot of enemy divisions trying to get in there. Now it is already almost September. Oh, and that's already out of supplies. Oh dear. Oh, basically out of supplies. You know what? I'm just going to pull that one back to Stalingrad. Have some troops defending this area at least. And we might need some uh, reserves there soon enough. Right, so we are taking that one. I could do a bit of a, a nudge through there. Then you can take these two. Because we're pushing through there. Are we pushing through this one? I think we are soon enough. 
And they've got two divisions attacking them here, but we've got reinforcements arriving soon. How's this combat going? It is going. We've got the... Ooh, right, actually. I forget. Did we already win this? I suppose we did. I believe we've done the logistical bombing in here, but let's, um... Done the other, I'll do the other province as well, just in case. I want to check this bombardment first. So there's 260 supplies in there. Okay, so which uh, province did we lose? This one, okay. Oh, no, wait. Edovitsa. Oh, was it over here again? No, 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 not there. We've gone up enough with it. I probably haven't. No, I'm pretty sure there's over there, but it's just... Uh, it's very slow advancing, really. Like, we'll try to get there, but it just... It takes time. Uh, right, so I was looking at the bombardment over there, but at the same time I was trying to find... Where did we have the division that shattered? Because that might be... Either bad news or really bad news. Oh, it was to here. Right, well, we've got some reinforcements in there at least. Is that going to hold? I think it might be. And how are the divisions that have shattered doing in here? Um, quite badly. Okay, so we lost that one. We at least won the combat there. Right, so it was 260 supplies, now it's 180. Looks like we don't need to be doing the logistical bombing for all that many days. Rizhov is under attack. We've got two divisions defending, so I think we'll be alright there. Got some reinforcements coming in here. Um... That's going to be taken. I'm just going to move in there. I'm going to move in there. We are going to get up to there already. Oh, we found some more... Oh dear, this time we have started taking some uh, damage from the submarines. But we did sink another one. Here is Taldum. This is near Moscow. Oh, this one. Oh, right. Okay. Lumich. Uh, <laughs> I think we have some troops over here that really desperately need to be moved out. Well, I don't really have the situation over here to do that. Let's move in one of the divisions across the river, at least there. How are we doing on this side? Slow. To say the least. Okay, so that torpedo boat is going to be lost very shortly. At least it has... Actually, how many has it sank total? Two submarines. Okay, so I think it's paid itself at least. Oh yeah, we do actually have a bit more troops over here, but at the same time... Frankly, what I should be doing is... Uh, have a look at the supply lines and... Just Start sending in some of the troops to guard the supply line. I will send one there. Maybe another one there. But there are some supplies being brought up the stuff here as well. But how bad is the rebel risk? Actually, down here is not bad at all. Somehow. I'm not entirely sure how, but... I'm not going to question it. There's, we'll leave one at least here, then this one could be pushed forward. We've got a fair bit around Ashrakhan. I'll just spread them out. Okay, it looks like... Oh. Order save and a pause at the same time. Let's hope it doesn't crash. Oh, it looks like the Soviet uh, submarines are retreating from the combat. So the submarine might actually survive. There we go, we sank four of them. 
I'm just gonna send this one back to Narvik. If he has security coast on him, maybe. All we know. <laughs> 